Like this right here is like a perfect moment that I hope for in every blue day, blue sky day. It's like when the clouds come and cover the sun just for that moment where the light becomes soft again. Takes away all those harsh shadows. Gives you nice even light across the board. Yeah, it's a beautiful thing. Going back to the project of this class and talking about our photo essay, we are at LaSalle Bridge in Chicago over the Chicago River. Uh, it's just very iconic to Chicago, not only the Chicago River, but all these bridges and the architecture of it. So just telling my city's story from my perspective, of course I'm gonna include this city, uh, bridges and river. So one of my favorite things to utilize in photography are these things called universal symbols. I also like to call them cheat codes. And there are things like bridges and yellow taxi cabs and red balloons, things that just as a kid we've grown to love and enjoy and see all the time. So when we see like photos of bridges or photos of yellow taxi cabs, it's just like subconsciously it's easier for the viewer to feel part of that photo, to like that photo, to be engaged in that photo, to participate in it, and to feel some type of way. Uh, just to go back to the lighting, you can see that the cloud has passed and the sun is at full strength and the light is back to being harsh. You can see all the shadows. I get the shadow right here. You can see another one like right underneath the bridge right there. But even to the human eye, like, we can see this in normal detail right now in, in real life. But in a photo, this would be dark. You know what I mean? Because the sun is behind it. So this, would, this entire thing would be, act as a shadow all the way up to this point. But on a cloudy day where the light was soft or a cloud came over it, you'd be able to see in detail all of this, clear. But even here, like, another even difficulty of shooting in the harsh sun is like, being able to look over your photos, it's just difficult to see exactly. Yeah, with the sun being out like this, I wouldn't even be here, so like, let's just go. Looking for reflections, looking for a dope reflection. This puddle is actually massive. You see like, I don't know if you can see it, but in this big puddle, there's tons of vibrations from the wind and just from sound and stuff. But if you look at this one, small puddle, it's super still. If you actually um, flip your phone upside down too, you can get the lens closer to the puddle. You can just get a, a deeper reflection. There's less space, so it actually, mirrors uh, even better.